What is up guys, Oscar Cho here and today we're unboxing the BAM box for this month. And so of course it's October so I assume there to be Halloween related stuff in this and like horror movie, scary movie, stuff like that. So let's open it if I can get the box cut open. There we go. Cut into the actual box. So let's see what we got in here, paper as usual. So to start off with we have a little box like we've gotten in the past. Let's see what do we got in here. Um, I have no clue what this is. And so it's a looks like a coin or medallion from something. I don't know if you can see what's on there. There's stuff on both sides, so it looks of course like some ancient stuff of some sort. Again, I have no clue what this is at all. It's got some stuff written around it, but I have no clue. It doesn't look familiar. It does, but I don't know what it's from. Uh, I don't know. Of course, they put in a box that has absolutely nothing. There's two possibilities, and I don't know what the second possibility is. Because I know I've seen it before, I just can't think of what it's from. But it... Well, we'll find out from the yeah. thing. Um, actually, well, we may not, because they tend not to put those in here anymore. So, I don't know. If you know what it is, let us know down in the description, because I probably won't know. Uh, next up, we have our pin for the month, and it looks like we have Space, Space Ghost. Ghost. And it just says Space Ghost. I thought maybe say something else. So we have Space Ghost as our pin. So that's awesome. We should get a book because um, we did get a one-up thing. So I don't know if that's the pin or not. Again, I have no clue what these are, but they should have a paper or something. But I don't know if they will or not. Maybe. Then next up we got our patch. And it is the Watchmen patch. So a little smiley face with the blood splatter on it. So that's, of course, from the Watchmen comic and in the movie and stuff like that. And so we got a Watchmen patch, which is awesome. Next up, oh, this is kind of cool. We have a hat, like a beanie, or I don't know exactly what they call it. Some people call them toboggans or something, kind of thing. But it's more of a mask, and it's of Deadpool. And so, I'm gonna have to put this on real quick. Okay, so now I'm Deadpool. And so, this is what the mask is. So, it's just like a, I thought it was like a toboggan type thing. But it's more just like a full mask, because I thought it was a thing, obviously, where you can, like, you know, have it rolled up, but it's kind of way too big for that. So yeah, it's just a mask, a Deadpool mask, and I like how it has the little point on the top, like his mask has, because normally it would just be like a whole, just, you know, solid thing, but they have the little point and everything, it's got mesh eyes, which are kind of cool, because you can see pretty decent out of, and then of course no mouth and stuff, so it's a really cool, cool uh, Deadpool mask going on there, so that's pretty cool. And next up here now we have some pictures, and so it looks like our first picture up is a Defenders picture, of course, from the Netflix series. And so we have Deadpool, Jessica Jones, um, Luke Cage, and Iron Fist all on there. So of course this is an awesome painting. And the um, COA says, um, art print the, the Defenders as hand signed by artist Logan Pack. And so that's his signature down there on the bottom. And it's 84 of 1500. There, so that's a cool picture if you like the Netflix series and stuff. And I like the, their pictures up there, of course, with like their matching colors and then little silhouettes down there on the bottom. I think that looks really cool. For that. And then our last thing out of the box. Oh, this looks really cool. Oh, we have a BB-8 picture, and this looks super cool. Look at the design of BB there. And I like all the color. Of course, we have the Rebels logo there in the background. And it's signed, of course, I assume, by the artist. And this is 50 out of 250, so this is a kind of a limited one and it doesn't yeah it doesn't feel like the picture has any like feeling because the, by the design it looks like it's a lenticular picture but it's not but the thing says this um, BB-8 photo has been hand signed by Brian Herring um, so the artist of the picture and that just looks cool. I love that picture of BB-8 that's so cool and then we did get a book for this month so that's awesome um, so we have oh I guess this was September's Oh, I forgot that they... Because I was thinking we got this box really early for one thing. But I forgot that there was a delay in September's box. And so that's what this is. I thought it was October. This is September's. Um, so, of course, there's no theme or anything. But I like the um, picture of the um, Star Destroyer flying over there. So first up, we have the Space Ghost. And so, so yeah, this is not our limit or our special item, whatever. Because um, there were two other options of a more limited quality. So there was a ship and then him sitting at the desk were the other options. Then we got the Watchmen patch there. Uh, then we got the BB-8 picture, which it shows three different ones. So I assume, um, okay, so now I see where the coin is from. 
Um, but we got the pictures there, uh, three different ones, and of course we got that one. So I assume that was probably our limited one. Yeah, some will see a one-up card with in a metallic photo. So I guess that's why it looked like that. It's a metallic photo that's signed and numbered out of 250. And so then the coin here is from the Goonies. So I assume this is One-Eyed Willie's coin or something that, of course, they used to get into, like, the boat or something like that. Um, but I remember this from the movie now. Like I said, it looked familiar, but I had no clue. There was nothing on there signify signifying where it came from at all. But now we know that. So it says a Spanish doubloon. Um, of course, one I release currency and all that sort of stuff. Then next up, we got our Defenders picture here. And so again, it looks like there are actually three pictures you could have got. Two by this artist, one with this, and then one in all black and white. So I kind of like this one a lot better. And then there was another one by some other artist where they're all playing in a band. It's kind of hard to see there, but they're all playing an instrument or something. And there, And then, of course, the last thing is our Deadpool replica mask here which looks awesome so there's the picture of it right there of that and so of course on the back here we have some other stuff so of course they have the one up which we did end up getting with that picture which is cool they have the new horror block so if you're a fan of horror you can um, subscribe to BAM box to get that and then they have the contest it says when a signed or Jason David Frank signed Green Power Ranger which would be awesome Funko Pop of Tommy for subscribers only and just enter oh, I thought I would have the instructions but so go to their web page and not um, fill out. So that'd be cool to win that green uh, ranger signed by Jason David Frank. That'd be awesome. I'd love that. And so that is it for this band box. So bro, what was your favorite item out of this box? Uh, probably the Deadpool mask. This mask is pretty cool. When I saw this was in the box, I'm like, oh, that's going to be, you know, kind of stupid. Because, like I said, I thought it was a hat and just a hat that, you know, you could pull down over your face. But that's, it's an actual, like, mask and stuff. And the material's not that bad. Like, it doesn't feel that cheap. And, like, it almost could be Deadpool. I mean, obviously, it's a cheaper material. That's why it's in a box like this. But, like, it almost could be Deadpool's outfit. Obviously, the eyes would are different. But it looks... It impressed me more than I thought, but probably the BB-8 is probably going to be my favorite. Just because I love BB-8 and this picture looks awesome and the metallic of it, as it said. So I definitely want to get this in a picture frame. That just looks so cool. But that's going to be it for the BAM box for September, not October. So if you enjoyed this unboxing, please leave a thumbs up. Leave any comments for me that you have down below. Especially let me know that that was a Goonies coin, how I didn't really see that or anything. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Do all that for me, and we'll see you next time.